Hi everyone and thank you very much first of all for joining me in this video. So in this lecture I am going to show you this face login system wherein if a user has a profile registered on the application right and he has updated his profile correctly with correctly I mean to say he has uploaded his photograph also and he has um, you know mentioned all the points information about all the points mentioned in his uh, profile correctly the system will be able to locate his profile in the application based on the images it will click through the camera of the device and it will allow the user to directly log in into the system without letting the user log in through these login credentials so it means that the user don't have to worry about uh, keying these username and password again and again logging into the system he just have to come in front of the devices camera and the application will simply redirect him to the page where he'll see his profile and you know the other modules of the application so how all this happens that's what we will be talking about that's what we'll be seeing in this video so stay tuned with me and do not forget to like and share this video in your group if you find this application extremely interesting you and you want the code of this application or you want to develop this application or you want me to develop an application like this for you, you can contact me on the number which is getting reflected on your screen right now. So let's dive into the tutorial without wasting any more time. So as you can see right now, uh, this invalid user message is getting reflected on the screen for me. Why? Because I have not registered any profile under my name on this application. So basically it's a Django based application wherein, you know, we have integrated phase detection mechanism also in it. Okay, now how that works, that's what we'll see. So I'm, I'm going to first create an account under my name. Here I'll have to put a username. So let me push in. Okay, a user with the username already exists. Uh, let me change it to this and here I'm going to put 1266 and now let me again put the password over here. Okay, so I've successfully registered uh, a profile under my name and now I'm going to simply log in into the application first. Okay, so this is the dashboard and here if I click on my uh, you know username, I get to see these options. Let's come on profile and let's quickly update the profile. So right now, as you can see, you know, there is a default image which has been set up by the application for my profile. So I would like to simply remove it and change it with the one which I just click before shooting this video okay and here I'm going to put my location birth date let it be this okay and let's update okay so successfully updated my profile and now as you can see the image has been replaced by the one which I just uploaded okay so let's go back okay, let me do one thing let me simply access the login screen now okay so it's it has detected my face right it was able to detect my face and it has redirected me to my profile okay that's great let me let us see it again so I'm going to simply do this login and as you can see welcome Jan Gaurav 1266 is coming down at the place where we were seeing invalid user earlier okay let's check it out again no problem it's really interesting login yeah so now it's invalid user okay and now it has changed to welcome Jan to success so this is how the application works and you know once it detects the face it's able to, if it is able to find the correct match based on the phase detection in the database 
it redirects the user to his or her respective profile okay so as you can see this is my profile and let me just go back and change this image to something else okay i'll have to choose first i'm going to select this image and update okay update profile and now if i ever try to log in into the system what's going to happen let's check it out so it says invalid user right it's not able to detect my face it's it's able to detect my face but it's not able to find the match for my face in the database of the application right and let me show you what is happening in the back end so this is what we are getting internal server error why because it's not finding match or based on the photos it is clicking through the cameras cam devices camera okay let's log in sorry let's log in like this and i'm going to quickly change my profile pic okay i have updated my profile and let me see if this time it will be able to detect my face and redirect me to the login screen or not okay it has detected my face uh, and it has redirected me to my profile okay so this is how this application works i hope you guys enjoyed this lecture a lot if you want to build these kind of applications you need to learn complete full stack mechanism right you need to learn libraries which helps us in face detection which can help you in creating stuffs based on artificial intelligence and if you need my help in that let me know on the number which is there getting reflected on your screen right now okay you can contact me on my whatsapp also and I'm, i'm on whatsapp on this very same number which you're seeing right now okay let me know about your queries and if you are creating something like this please share it in the description section okay in the con in the comment section of the video i will be happy to see your work thank you very much for being with me in this tutorial i hope you guys liked it bye bye take care and have a great great day ahead guys